hello guys welcome to my YouTube channel this is Joy Abzo today we are coming to design student ID card using Microsoft PowerPoint stay tuned So first of all, we we'll open our PowerPoint software. Here I'm using Microsoft PowerPoint 2013 version. You can use any version at all, whether 2007, 2010, 2013, which I'm using 2016 or 2019. Any of the versions can work for you. So when you open, we'll be using the blank presentation for it. So I open you now we we'll go to design. We want to change the slide size. So here what the basically the ID card the width is two times the height. So I'll be using 18 by 9 centimeters. So I'll custom it here. 18 by 9. Though printing it out will be bigger, but that's what I'll be using to make it look a bit bigger for me in the design. But you can use lesser than that. So 18 is to 9. So when you have that done, we'll clear off the screen. Whatever that is on the screen, we'll take it off. We we'll just select and clear them off. I will now come, will now insert a rectangle. So I'll use the round rectangle. So I'll insert it up here. Let's down. I'll reduce the curvature. Then when I go to format shape fold, I'll be using green, which is not here. So I'll go to more colors. Now more colors, so the red will be 0, blue 0, and the green will be 255, five, giving it pure green. Shape outline, I'll make it to no outline. So after this, I'll insert a line. On it. So to keep the line straight, you will hit on your shift key. And no matter where you go, it will still be straight on it. And when you come, shape outline will be white. And the width we will use six points for the width. After that, we will insert the school logo. So these are the resources I'm using. So I just drag and drop it into my PowerPoint. So, so I hold shift and resize it so that the aspect ratio will not change. So I resize it and put it there. I'll put some background behind it since the picture doesn't have a background. So I'll go to format. So I'll click here, format shape. Now I come here, I have fill. So I'll change it to solid color, then the color will be white. And I'll come here, I want to make the edges a bit round instead of being perfect square. So I just crop it to shape. And reduce the curvature small. And that is it. I will now insert another rectangle down there, round rectangle.
and change the shape fill to green then I'll pick my picture the ID picture and put it inside so to resize it hit on the shift key in case you don't want to change aspect ratio and place it here so that one to have copy to shape rounded rectangle and I'll add picture border to it green color and I'll now crop it so this is okay for that side and this I will move the outline and make outline to be no outline so I'll now insert the information so there's student name here control A to select all and I'll now type These are my names. My surname is not included here. I will change the font to area. Now copy the same thing, control C and paste the control V a bit down and insert and type in the course so BSC Mathematics. I'll reduce the font size. So the shortcut for reducing font size is control shift and the left less than sign that is the shortcut for uh, reducing the font and I change the font style to Times New Roman I remove the bold so I'll increase the sign a bit Okay, and I'll now insert the course information. Let me just remove these graded lines to the side because I'll be using them actually here. So I'll now insert the information. So I just copy this and paste it and bring it down here. Then I'll type SMS. I'm just using a random student ID the unique identification number the campus nationality so I just reduce the font size and in between each of them I'll 
uh, hit on the tab key to give them some form of spacing. So I also copy down and paste down here. Then at this point, I'll now identify them. So index. Unique, unique identification number, campus, final nationality. I change, I'll remove the bold from it and change the font size, font family to Times New Roman. The font size also. Okay, sync. So I just increase the spacing here and that of here. All right. I change the font face. The font color to green. Mm. I'll now insert the name of the school. So I also copy this one. Control C, Control V. I'll now type the school. University for Development Studies. That is UDS. And that is the name of my school. Case okay, it's, it's located in Ghana, one of the biggest schools in Ghana. Noted for our third time start practical field examinations. You can go to our website and check on it in case you want to be in university. A school with practical education. So the website is www uds.edu.gh So I just increase the font size a bit. It's just six now make it fifteen. Fourteen will do. Okay. So it simply increases give the font the name more space now remove the shadow from it for the bold it's okay and I also copy the same thing down here student ID card. So bring it down here. No. Okay. So simply, we have just designed a student ID card with PowerPoint, and to save it as a picture, you hit on control you just go to file save us you go to your directory then you select dot jpeg jpeg that's the best way to save so i just name it my student id Uh, to save you can also save the main file so i'll just save it as student id and that is it for the first part so in case 
there are several strengths and you just want to design for them what you simply do is you just click on this click on the thumbnail and press ctrl d it will take you to the next line and you can simply alter by changing the picture if you go to change picture you select you go to your directory so I just go to my command directory here to for you So I use this picture and crop it. So what I can simply do is just to crop it to suit an ID. So just click on the crop and we adjust it. That's it. So you cannot change. You change the name to. So let's say using this. So I just change only the cell name here. You just simply change the whole name, and the ID also. So this being it the same here. So this will now be nine nine zero. And the other details will then need to be changed. And basically. That was it for the student ID card design in Microsoft PowerPoint. If you like this video, kindly subscribe. If you are not subscribed, hit on the subscribe button, share it to your friends and your loved ones, and also comment if you have any question or suggestion as to how to do as to what kind of tutorials you want me to be doing on this website as you all know the web on this channel the name is joyabzo and see you soon and also don't forget to stay at home coronavirus is real